The U.S. Army announced a modification to contract W-56HCV-23C-0024, awarding BAE Systems Land and Armaments LP in York, Pennsylvania, a contract worth $432,590,330 for the procurement of armored multipurpose vehicles (AMPVs). The work will take place in York, Pennsylvania, and is expected to be completed by February 28, 2027. This funding comes from fiscal years 2022 and 2023, specifically for the procurement of weapons and tracked combat vehicles for the Army. The total value of the initial vehicle order is $797 million, with additional options that could bring the total contract value up to $1.6 billion. The AMPV is set to replace the M113 family of vehicles, which make up around 30% of tracked vehicles in Armored Brigade Combat Teams ABCTs. This transition is aimed at addressing the M113's deficiencies in terms of protection, force security, mobility, and power while also allowing for future technology integration and network compatibility with the Army. Major Gen. Glenn Dean Program Executive Officer for Ground Combat Systems, emphasized the significance of the AMPV as a substantial investment decision for the Army, considering the extensive presence of the M113 family of vehicles in ABCTs. The AMPV offers enhanced protection and survivability for soldiers while simplifying logistical and mechanical complexities within ABCTs by sharing a common powertrain and suspension with other vehicles like the M2 Bradley Infantry Fighting Vehicle and the M109A7 Paladin Self-Propelled Howitzer. The 1st Armored Brigade Combat Team of the 3rd Infantry Division was the first unit to transition from M113S to AMPVs. After comprehensive training, they received over 130 AMPVs in July to complete a full set. The Army is following a phased approach to the development, production, and deployment of the AMPV. More than 276 vehicles have already been acquired out of the planned 450, which are scheduled for delivery by the end of 2024. Full-rate production vehicle deliveries are expected to begin in early 2025. The AMPV is among the top 35 modernization priorities for the Army and aligns with the strategy of ensuring protection, mobility, reliability, and interoperability. Over the next two decades, the Army envisions a global fleet of nearly 3,000 AMPVs, comprising five different variants to provide commanders with versatile capabilities for maneuvering across diverse ABCT battlefield scenarios. Major General Glenn Dean reiterated that the range of AMPV variants equips commanders with effective tools for navigating various ABCT battlefield situations.